Don't forget to like, subscribe and share the videos. 230 km fire work complete on bullet train project. Vaishnav. See, from the uh, heading itself, you could be able to know that the 230 km of fire work has been completed in Maharashtra, Mumbai, Ahmedabad bullet train corridor. So, under prelims, it is related to economic and social development. Similarly, under mains, it is related to GS paper 3. Under economic development, a subtopic called infrastructure that is energy, ports, roads, airports, railways, etc. Let us move on to the news. See, the National High Speed Rail Corporation Limited, which is responsible for building the corridor, as what it has said is that nearly 100 km of wide act has been laid and 230 km of firework has been laid in the Mumbai Ahmedabad High Speed Rail Corridor. And this wide act cross crosses six Gujarat rivers, namely Par, Auranga, Purna, Dola, Ambiga, Vengainia. So, these are, uh, this reverse is very important from the prelims perspective. And the full span launching techniques where the 40 meters long box graders have been built with the help of state of art equipments. See, what is this full span launching technique is? See, where a design or the concrete design will be constructed in the in the separate store and after the concrete which has been constructed in the store will be taken to the site where it, uh, where it has to be built or where it has to be erected. So, such kind of technique is called as full span launching technique. So, let us move on to what is this Mumbai Ahmedabad high speed rail corridor is about. It is India's first high speed rail line and the train will run at a speed of 350 km per hour, but the operational speed will be 320 km per hour. And the total length of the bullet uh, train is going, corridor is going to be 508.17 km and the slab track system has been used for laying tracks rather than the balloted conventional tracks. And then what is the difference between uh, this bullet train as well as the airlines is there will be less check-in time, more leg space and above all the connectivity which is these are all the, the connectivity, the, this corridors or the area's connectivity has been denied on aeroplane, airplanes for most period of time. And it has been funded by Japanese with a mere 0.1 percentage of interest rate for 50 years. That is within 50 years, our government need to repay back the money. So, what is this National High Speed Rail Corporation is about? It is incorporated in 2016 under Companies Act 2013 and its objective is to finance the finance construct as well as maintain the high speed rail corridor in India and it has been modeled in the line of special purpose vehicle where the partic uh, equity participating stakeholders are central government and the state governments that is the Maharashtra government as well as the Gujarat government. So, this is what the map is about and we could able to see that there are 4 stations in uh, Maharashtra for this rail corridor and 8 station for Gujarat in this rail corridor. So, this is how the corridor has been built. So, what need to be studied for this? We should know about what is RRTA, what is metro rail and the difference between these with the conventional trains and uh, ballast technology and then IRCTC. So, these are all the other areas which we need to be further aware of and with this we have reached the end of this topic.